Okay, as you know, it is seemingly the wild west out there on the roads and the highways when a crash happens. Tow truck drivers, you see them everywhere, racing to the scene, getting to our vehicles, and then what's being done, and some of it even being connected to criminal activity. So City News reporter Mark McAllister joins us now. Let's begin there. We've seen these turf wars making all the headlines. It's unreal. Over the last year, we have seen significant police investigations leading to massive arrests and guns and weapons being um, <clears throat> confiscated as a result to the point that even last weekend a couple of tow truck employees company employees ended up being shot and uh, so we're seeing that all over the place and it's probably as a result of a lack of provincial regulation in the uh, in the province right so you know let's say your car breaks down all of a sudden you're surrounded and you often see three four tow trucks that are all along there how's that all happening Basically, there's a lack of rules, and what we see is these chasers, so to speak, making their way to these collision scenes, trying to convince the driver, no, I'm your guy. Yeah. I'm going to be the one to tow your truck away because ultimately there are the bad apples out there that will take your car and then put you in a situation where you end up having to pay massive amounts of money because they're putting your car at a collision center that is probably in connection with and then before you can get your car out, oh, by the way, you need this done, this done, this done, and we're going to charge you thousands of dollars before you can actually get your car back. And that's when insurance companies get involved. Sure, and then you're out. So what can the OPP do? Well, at this point, the OPP, if they show up on a collision, they can help you decide which of the tow trucks needs to take your car away when they're on the scene. Um, and then, or they can decide for you, you're going to take this one because... We know the other ones may not be all that reputable. Yeah, there are some things that you should be looking out for. I know tonight on your uh, story on City News, uh, there are a list of things you should be on the lookout for. Well, the CAA, they, they hand out these cards to their members. Mm -hmm. It's called a uh, towing bill of rights. They've got a number of things that they have brought up. Uh, for instance, you want to ha you have that right to decide. If a bunch of trucks show up at a scene, you have the ability to say, no, I want this one or refuse them all I'm gonna call my own mm -hmm. that way I know that uh, this company this driver is going to be the one I want they're gonna take it to exactly where I want and it's very important to keep in mind that before you do anything make sure you sign a form a legal document yes. that says here's exactly what's going to happen with my vehicle here's where you're going to take it here's how much you're going to charge me otherwise it's a free-for-all often when you're on the side of the road though you're not thinking about all of these you're things, in distress right? you're, yeah. it's one of those things where you're not thinking straight and as a result they take advantage sometimes sure okay so citynews.ca citynews at five and six tonight for your full story definitely okay mark thank you